What's up, everybody? Hey. It's Parker Taylor. And Paige. Taylor Twitch Training. Um, so today we're gonna do some arms. The few ways that we like, I guess, hit arms, yeah, you can say, is uh, we'll either do like supersets, like bicep, triceps, supersets, or we'll just do like biceps first or triceps first. Um, if you have like more of a lagging bicep or tricep, you could probably get started with that first. I think today we're gonna do biceps and then triceps, just cause we want to. Uh, we haven't hit like just an arm day in a long time. We usually do like back and tri like back and buys or like chest and tries or like the other way around, just kind of switch it up. So yeah, this will be our first arm day in a little bit. I don't think we're doing anything too heavy. We're trying to get a good pump, but yeah, you ready? Yeah. All right, let's do it. All right, so we're just getting warmed up with the biceps. Um, I usually like to get start on the cable. The reason being is you got to get a good pump, good contraction without having like too much weight. Just from like the type of resistance the cable gives you. Um, and I like the rope just because you can kind of change your hand position, get everything going, get a good view. Um, the first rule, the first rule of making gains is you have to bat heavy so. <laughs> What did you say? <laughs> yeah, I said the first rule of making gains, you have to match heavy so. If you're ugly, you can't make gains. That's so, so head ass. <laughs> oh my god. Yeah, you have to be serious, bro. Match. You just gotta make sure the elbow doesn't move. Stretch all the way down the bottom. Hold at the top. Yeah, nice stretch and squeeze. It's all about building that mind muscle connection. Gotta get up in that bicep, baby. Look at that. Look at those gains. But yeah, just high rep range. Like 20, 20 plus, just get all that blood pumping. Lightweight. Be in our video. Ah, uh, what's up? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we're, what's the video? Uh, what's up? What's up? It's the Wanda. What's up, everybody? So there's like, so there's like two different ways we kind of think of bicep training. And the reason being, like, I guess I want to say two different ways. But the thing that you need to know is that for your bicep, there's two. Bi, bi means two. So there's two heads to your bicep: your long head and short head. Short head's more for like the thickness. Long head's for more of that bicep peak. And that's kind of what I like in as like bodybuilding bro um, so it's not like too crucial for anybody that just kind of like wants to get in shape or like you know just look better uh, but if you do want to build muscle and everything like that it is good to have that in mind so like the we're about to do the straight bar curl is like the, the most original like bicep exercise that you can do and it will work the whole head but I guess it is more short head dominant whenever you turn your hand or you supinate your hands that allows it to be a little bit more long head dominant um, so yeah, just kind of think about that whenever you do want to build muscle. We always think about angles. It's all about angles for us. That's the way we train. That's why we like to train. Switching up the angles gives us different pump. They're like switching up the rep tempo. That all kind of goes into different like pump, different muscle building. You can't really just do the same thing day in and day out and expect to have muscle growth. So, You're hating on some people. Yeah. <laughs> Okay, so I usually like to use neutral grip because that pretty much means taking your hands down. So from bringing my hands out to in, that changes the way your muscle contracts. So this again, if you bring your hands in, it's gonna hit more of a long head with P2 bicep. You're gonna hit more out and more of a short head. Um, again, yeah, that's a different angle. That's the idea of different angles. Hit different muscle groups. Different muscle groups. Coles gym members and guests, could Malcolm Please come to the front, Malcolm. Yeah, the full stretch, the full squeeze. Usually the barbell for us doesn't get past our chest. It's usually about chest height. If it goes to your face, that probably means that you're moving your elbows. Another good thing about a straight bar curl is that it kind of it builds nice and thick forearms. Let's see the intensity. Let's see the intensity. Oh! 
Where's your uh, fake screaming face? Oh, shit. What? I said, where's your... For some reason, I always have a hard time with the Like, I, I don't know why. It's hard for me to figure out sometimes to get, like, a good level or isolation. Um, but that last... What's that? Alright, so we only got like a third of that arm workout because somebody complained and told it and they yeah complained and we were not allowed to record and everything like that. And so I see like a couple I get a couple things out of that. And like the first way not to be like mean, I'm kinda of just being honest and it might hurt somebody's feelings. But nobody cares about you like nobody Nobody's Nobody worried about you. Nobody cares if you walk back. Nobody's the worried about you. Barely anybody's worried about us. We have like 20 people, anyways. Nobody's worried about you. Nobody's worried about you. Okay? That's what I get out of it. So don't be. If you are worried about us taking a couple clips, you are apparently not focused on yourself. That's what I'd see it as. Like you need to focus more on yourself and rather than other people. And then, kind of the second thing I get out of that, after that little rant, after like the second thing that I get out of it, is that we can't sometimes we can't control things and the way you react to like I guess diversity or stuff that you can't control that kind of shows what kind of type of character you have or like what kind of person you are so if we were kind of got up like I got a little frustrated I got a little upset so I tried to calm down a little bit I thought about it I was like I can't be like a bitch I can be real mean and just you know be upset the, like the whole time while we were trying to like work out and you'd be real butthurt about it or you can kind of like take a step back Realize that not everybody's gonna like what you're doing, in a way. Not everybody's gonna agree with what you're doing, which is all right. Um, and so just kind of- And you can't let other people have an effect on you. Yeah, you can't let other But yeah, just kind of take a step back, realize that others will won't, but not everybody likes what you're doing, um, and go from there. So calm down, yeah. I'm trying to kind of go from there. But yeah, just, I don't know. It's just how you react to things that you can't control. That's what I'm trying to say. So, yeah, calm down. Jeez, I'm just repeating myself. Well, and you shouldn't make decisions when you're pissed. Yeah, that's right. Emotions. You shouldn't say anything yeah, you shouldn't when you're mad. Yeah, anger is probably the worst emotion. Yeah. Yeah, it really is. But, yeah, so there's something other that's affect you. And, we, and what we'll get out of this is kind of different ideas and, like, a different solution that we can apply to recording and everything like that. Um, but, yeah. Yeah. Alright, so next time, we'll, we'll still upload the video, like what we have. Um, it's only like biceps. Yeah, it's only basically. biceps again. But we'll get, a, we'll get a tricep video soon. So I guess <laughs> like, comment, subscribe, bro. No, I'm just kidding, you have to do that shit. But, but yeah. I would say, but yeah, well, <laughs> I say.